I think the school attracts a certain kind of uh, student. You know, a lot of the you know kids I grew up with, uh, we grew up with sports. You know, we played different sports in different seasons. You know, it was kind of baseball in the you know spring and summer, golf for me, basketball in the winter. Um, so a lot of the kids that um, <clears throat> you know I grew up with that were friends and, and that I associated with them just played sports all year long. And I think a lot of the kids that went to London played you know played sports. I, I grew up with the game of golf. My dad was a huge golfer. <clears throat> I grew up kind of across the street from Bellevue Country Club uh, in Syracuse. And um, ever since I was about eight years old, I would tag along with my dad caddying for him and eventually started playing more and, and uh, you know, started working at, at Bellevue. And, you know, when the snow wasn't on the ground, I was out playing golf. And I still play the game uh, a lot today. It's one of those games where you can, you know, keep your skill level pretty high, you know, with technology, just keep it in shape. And it's just one of those things you can do your whole life. And I'm playing as much golf now as I have pretty much my whole life. Um, but it was my, myself and Tim uh, Murph, uh, Mark Fallon, John Flynn, Ted Kelly, and Jeff Myers uh, were, the, were the six guys that played um, on the team when we won the state championship. We actually played better at the sectional than we did at the state. We, I remember we had a very good day uh, that day at Seven Oaks and won that um, sectionals by a pretty good margin. And that qualified us to go down to Cornell a week or two later. I remember we played good, not great but it was a very tough course. I remember it was tough conditions. And uh, we, you know, we just did well enough to beat everybody else in the state. Kind of the ironic thing after we won it as a, as a team, for some reason, the state eliminated the team competition aspect of golf. It was just an individual uh, game um, from a state level after that. So we were the, I'm not sure if it's changed since 81, but you know, we may still be the last state championship <laughs> golf team um, in New York state history. You know, Ludden, was a good school first off from an education standpoint. You know, a lot of the things you learned there was great prep for uh, college and beyond. You know, you learn to get a, along with people, how to work with people, how to, you know, develop relationships with uh, with people. You know, I, I think it was all about helping you find who you are as a person and kind of laying the groundwork for what you, you know, will become as an adult, you know, and become a you know, contributing member of of society, you know, and the, the memories of our, our team really weren't so much on the golf course of, you know, making a putt or hitting a good drive or whatever. The, the memories from our, our team were just kind of us being together, you know, riding in cars to different golf courses, you know, being just kind of being together, you know, doing practicing together, um, you know, being down at Cornell, staying in the dorms, you know, together and trying to stay out of trouble as best we could. I mean, there's not a day that goes by we have a text group that somebody chimes in with something you know and this is you know 40 years later after we graduated so it's just you know it's been a lot of friendships and uh you know, relationships over the years see our achievement we had back in 1981 will live on forever and uh and to go in you know all six all six of us uh, being inducted i think is even making you know more special